Alright, hello everybody, and welcome back to my friend plays Fallout 2 for the very first time. My name's Alan. My name's Galen. And we're here today, still in the tutorial. Um, the tutorial here that was added by uh, Fallout 2 um, was actually something that Tim Kaine uh, was opposed to. He did not want there to be a tutorial like this in the game. Um, so, uh, oh, they only have five. Okay. Yeah, they Got don't it. have a uh, ton of range. Oh, I don't want to do the targeted. I kept trying to figure out why I was getting away from them because I was like, using... <laughs> yeah. shit, that I'm running away as fast as I can and I keep losing him. Why is he not catching up to me? Oh, don't be hitting me. Come on. Just kill the damn ant, dude. It's an ant. It's an exoskeleton. Just stab it once. That's all you gotta do. There you go. There you go. Nice. You got it. It's an exoskeleton. All you have to do is stab it once. I mean, I guess that's yeah, because true. Because they're it, like it'll, it'll hydraulically die, operated. Um, more or less. For their... Um, I forget the term for it, but so like they're hydraulically um, inclined for when they extend out. That's why when bugs die, they curl their legs up because their legs that curl up um, as actual muscle. Mm, that's interesting. Yeah, so their curling action is muscle. They're hydra hydraulically based for when they extend. Hmm. I didn't know that. Um, I do know that there are some goodies around here. Um, around the place. So if you hold down I'm shift, shift and like, I'm yeah, shifting as hard as I can, Captain. Oh, there's another ant. Oh, there's okay. also a good amount of experience in the form of creatures for you to kill. Oh my God! You can... Come on, man. There you go. Nice. There's that, buddy. Now, am I reading this correctly? You have 30 health. Is that right? Yes. Okay. Yes, that's correct. That's a good amount of health. Health was um, first stage five. Sure. You hit one point. Ooh, nice, good job. Yeah. Um, Failed doing healing. First aid might be. There we go. Um, nice. Four hit points. Nice. Yeah, I think first aid is a little bit more effective in this game than it is in Fallout 1. It's, it um, seems like it, yeah. You, you may want to dedicate some more skill points towards first aid than you did first in aid. Fallout 1. Yeah. And one thing I do want to point out in, in this uh, tutorial here is that there are traps. Oh. So, you know, be aware of that. Because... Oh. Uh, yeah, traps. There was a scorpion in here earlier. Where is the scorpion at? There were scorpions. There he is. Okay, I was going to say, I guess they just decided to go retire or something. Uh, I guess I could actually advance to him, couldn't I? Well, oh, there's two. Uh, you don't have the AP anymore. He engaged me though, so I do actually get my chance. Yes, you do. Oh, and cool. Now poisoned. you're poisoned. Immediately. Yeah, that could be bad for you. Great. I mean, it could be like a very mild poison. It could. That's you know, true. like it, it, you could just have poison ivy. <laughs> uh, there is a take all button now, by the I way. See that, that was not that's nice. There was, that was not in Fallout One, and we have it now. Skyrim much? <laughs> um, I found a um a new I way to play Skyrim, by the way. I don't remember if the take all button exists in Morrowind. Because uh, I know we, we spoiler alert. I guess uh, we've we've just started up. Well, no, it's not spoiler alert. No, by the time this episode comes out, yeah, by the time <laughs> this episode comes out, 
Morrowind will have come out. Um, so yeah, uh, you might want to rest until that poisoning goes away. Because that could be a problem for you. That's not in here. Where do I... Is that in Pip? Oh. Oh, you aren't wearing the Pip Boy. Oh. Oh, God. So I can't rest. No, don't save over that. Don't save over that. Don't save over that. Don't save you're over right, that. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. My bad. My bad. <laughs> Poisoned. <laughs> poison? There's poison in this game? <laughs> yes. Yes, there is. There we go. All right. Well. You, uh, your ability. Your ability with my... okay. you can try the doctor skill, but I don't think that that will work. Honestly. What is that, six? Yeah. Doctor, doctor, give me the news. You feel a little better. Oh, I healed. Alright, I'll take it. I healed. Okay. I'm taking one dam one damage per little while, so I'm not gonna worry about it. Stabbied once. In my turn. Stabby stabby. Stabby two more stab, times. stab stab stab. Got a sweep nice, sweep sweep. Killed it. Oh my god, okay, you yeah. killed him! There we go. Oh, I, I guess he had knocked he the body he backwards. All. I guess so, yeah. Sorry, what were you saying about take all? I wish it would close, just close out when you hit take all. Yeah, that would be nice. Ah, I just want to look at this thing, man. Oh, balls. Balls. No, I was saying I've, I found a new way to play Skyrim, right? Mm -hmm. It's quite fun. So um, what's the new way? So I got my fiance to uh, create a character a couple weeks ago in Skyrim to try it out. Just because obviously, mm -hmm. I mean, I love the game. But yeah, she I remember like you telling me she doesn't like the combat. Yeah, yeah, like I said, she doesn't like it's the just... combat, so... Uh, the way that we have, we've been uh, playing the game together on a single player a game is that she'll do the, all the adventuring, and if somebody starts attacking her, I'll just kill him. <laughs> so pass, <laughs> pass the controller, and I'll and I'll do the killing. It's honestly a fun way to play it because like there's enough combat in the game that it makes it like a 50/50 of like adventuring yeah. and combat. Yeah, I think and it's this... going to be interesting when we get to Skyrim uh, to see what differences and what similarities there are between our play styles. Um, yeah. I'll, I'll tell you right now, I'm very much a creature of habit, and I uh, kind of tend to... Um, so now you've got a second spear. You could use that one as, like, a throwing weapon uh, to, like, engage from afar, and then switch to the <laughs> other one and just stab with it. So there's an idea for you. Um, for sure. I'm tell I'll, I'll tell you right now. I'm very much a creature of habit. Um. Hey, you're not poisoned. Come on, heal me. Heal me up. Yeah, there we go. Nice. There you go. Um. And so I, I, I tend to do a lot of the same stuff over and over again whenever I... Uh... Oh my god, come on, dude. This freaking keyboard. Jesus. Yeah, he's struggling over there a little bit. Very much so. Um, We're out of capitalist, yeah. Oh well. See, so yeah, I, I, I tend to kind of like fall into the same patterns of... Uh, you know, I'm, I'm going to play the game this way and then the next time I play it I'm still going to play it that way and uh, 
I'm not going to talk too much about what I'm planning to do for my Skyrim run, but uh, I think it should be pretty interesting. I'm looking forward to it. The one In thing the that 20, I've really learned... Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Um, the one thing that I've really learned about Skyrim over the years is that um, you really, if you want to get strong, you can get really, really strong without exploiting any bugs or glitches or anything like that. Mm -hmm. uh, and you can, uh, so the door appears to be locked. So you can try to lockpick it. Um, uh oh, you know what we're gonna be doing here. Yeah. Oh, you did it. <sighs> Look at that. Good job. Look at that. Easy peasy. That was actually incredible. <laughs> All right, I'll just hit over this one. As well. I think that uh, somewhere mm. in that room there was also a uh, plastic explosive in a jar or something, and I was so looking around couldn't see anything. In here. Um, no? no, I think up to the right. I want to say. Um, are you holding down shift or? Yeah. Mm, okay. Um, I mean, I, I could be thinking of a different place, honestly. Uh, but anyway, um, I think that the ultimate solution for locked doors is that you can blow them up. Oh. Get out of here. Uh, Nike's windows with their stupid pop-ups. Lily. Oh, well, it's the pop-ups. I see. Yeah. Oh. Uh, that doesn't look good. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's not good. Okay, so it looks like there's a chest over there. Unless it's a bench. Looks like I don't a know chest, what yeah. that is. Wait, did it hit me? Get him. Oh, well, snikies. Well, you're poisoned again. Yeah. Kill the freaking thing, dude. Oh my gosh, he's not that bad shot. Yeah. You're, you're hurting now. I sure am. Oh, I realize the top of my head's kind of cut out of frame. Oops. It's uh -oh. okay. The brain. Seven <laughs> percent chance it might work. You missed. Damn it. What? Should have missed. Oh well, you live and learn. You need four action points. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. Jim. Nice. You did it. Did I already get to take this guy's? No, I didn't. That's a negatory. Alright, so yeah, you got your spear over there. Oh, there's another spear on the floor. Uh, back that way. I don't know if you want it, but... You are also seeing some raised plates, which means there's pressure plates here. So, um... You know, oh, there's... Yeah, actual spears. Sweet. Yeah, th there's like, uh... There's traps in this area. Yeah. Oh, that's nice, that's nice. Uh, I actually want to look at the, um, what's the strength of this. So, sharpened pole does 2 to uh, 7, spear does 3 to 13. Yeah. Yeah, it's not, that's a no brainer. I want to trigger a plate. You were hit for two points. 
You trigger the trap and narrowly avoid the projectile shot out from the wall. Are you just trying to die, or...? No, I just want to see... You just want to collect more spears? Yeah, obviously. What do we got in here? Anything? What do we got? What do we got? Sack. Gold? Oh, okay. It's a sack of something. It's a sack of something. I like how you hit the take all button after you'd already emptied it. Yeah, I, 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 don't, don't, don't call me on me. Just kidding. What is it? That was healing powder. Oh. Well, alright. I, I guess I mean... I Congratulations. Did, I, mean, I, needed, I did need yeah, that. Yeah, you so. found healing powder. Are we sure healing powder isn't uh, a banned narcotic? Because that's a uh, Yeah, it's, name, it's a little but... bit of nose candy. It's fine. You know, it it's gets uh, hyped up, man. Uh, but you know what? That's going to be the end of this episode. Thanks, everybody, so much for watching. Hope you really enjoyed it. Hey, make sure to drink plenty of water. Go out and do something nice for somebody. And as always, take it easy. Goodbye. Take care. How magnificent. What a beautiful way to die. Beautiful way to die